I wanted to do a short video here for you of uh, a lot of people ask how do you travel with your kind of corsos uh, and so I just wanted to show you I have a, a Jeep Grand Cherokee and it's nice because the front seat lays completely flat and I uh, and I just put a little bed here for Ozzy and uh, he's my co-pilot so uh, that works really well and then as you can see in the back there's Dolce and then there's Tux there's a lot of room in the back I pretty much just lay out uh, bedding for them there that's their orthopedic bed but you know you can throw some blankets or whatever and and uh, I got the little water dish right there. So lots of room. And the only thing I've, I've got to be careful of with Ozzy is if he uh, if he accidentally hits that gear shift. Um, he's on alert right now because we have a lot of deer in this area. So I think he sees one. So, but uh, what is it, Papa? What was it? But anyways, uh, so yeah, that's how we travel. That's how we roll. That's how we roll. Uh, it's It works out really well. What is it, Papa? What was it? What was it? And they love, love car rides. They really love car rides. Uh, there's a Dolce. See, they're a Dolce girl. They love it. Uh, Usually when I'm leaving the house, because we have a lot of deer in the area, they'll be, you know, doing this right here where they're, where they're really uh, glued to the road and the bushes to see what, if they see any deer out there. But once we get on the highway and start traveling, they just lay down and they pretty much go to sleep. I think it's because uh, the, the inside of the Jeep feels like a cave, probably like a den. They just love it. I know some dogs have anxiety traveling. Uh, none of my dogs have ever had anxiety traveling. Uh, they, it's quite the opposite. They just love it. So, anyway, uh, I'm gonna let y'all go. I just wanted to show you that a little bit of how we travel, and uh, and what the what the uh, car situation is like traveling with these big dogs. You know, honestly, I, I could actually fit another dog back there. Um, so I'm very soon going to get another kind of Corso. And uh, and I've thought about that, but, you know, it's, uh, it's definitely doable. So, all right. So we're, uh, we're getting out of that neighborhood where I told you there's a lot of deer. So they, they're starting to chill. And a little farm right there there's some animals but yeah as soon as we get get on the highway it's nap time i could travel cross country with these dogs and they pretty much sleep the entire way you know take them out to go to the bathroom every couple hours and they're good to go so anyway y'all have a good day and i'll talk to y'all later okay, bye guys say bye papa say bye papa